So in today's video, I'm going to share with you how you can change the payment date on an order inside of ZipPay. Keep watching. What's up guys? It's your main man Jeff from IAT2GM back with another video. So as I just recently stated, in today's video, I'm going to share with you how you can change the payment date on an order inside of ZipPay. So it's always going to come a time where you may need to up that you may need to extend that payment and i'm going to share with you in the video in this video how you can do so so without further ado let's not waste any time let's get straight into it all right guys so here we are here we are in one in the support article for how do i change my payment date so the way it works is um at least 24 hours they say at least 24 hours before an installment is due you can update your payment date by following the steps below so one you will head to the zip app and then you will tap orders on the bottom of your screen then from there you will select the order you would like to reschedule and at the bottom of that page you can select change schedule so as you can see right here as you can see right here this is an example of a payment schedule and you do see at the bottom where it says change payment schedule you go ahead and you change your payment um you hit that click that link and you could choose a new payment date for your next installment which can be moved up to seven days so they will all they will give you up to give you seven days forward at the max to um update to update your payment if you needed to um reschedule a payment that's what i mean to say future installments will also update based on that as well so as you can see right here choose your next payment date you can move your next payment date up to seven days future payments will also update uh after you do that you select continue and then you confirm to the new payment plan on the on the next page which is them showing this right here which would be the new payment plan based on you rescheduling um rescheduling the first payment and then you hit confirm payment and then after that they'll tell you this your next payment date is due xyz and then you you act you actually have confirmation of the new payment schedule and the payment schedule updated so your payment plan is now updated it's important to note that your account will be placed on hold until your next installment is paid meaning you won't be able to make any purchases in that time frame so that's the one caveat that the account is placed on a hold when you do a payment reschedule i guess that's just their way of protecting themselves to make sure that you aren't placing any other orders because they want to make sure that this um rescheduled payment you did does get paid so obviously uh, they do that to protect to cover their ass in so many words all right so what i do is i'll go and show you right now inside of one of my orders so this is an order i did right here you can see the same setup right the same exact setup so let's say say i want to hit change my pay date and let's say um choose your next payday i can move it up to seven days up to seven days future dates will also update as we just saw so what i would do is i will go ahead and let's just say because i plan on paying this ahead of time anyway but i'm just going to say the seventh right so i tap the seventh and as you can see december the seventh is what they have moved it up to so i hit continue review your new payment schedule as you can see this is the new payment schedule based on me rescheduling the payment that i just had to december the 7th and they telling me that my next payment will be due on december 7th your payment your account will be on hold until your next installment is paid now the only thing i would do is hit confirm payment plan but i'm not going to do that because i plan on using zip again probably before another video and i don't want to have my stuff on hold um so what i do is obviously go out of this but i will hit confirm payment plan and then once i hit confirm payment plan then the new schedule will be in um the new schedule will actually be in place for me to use but for now i'm going to go ahead and just cancel that and there you have it guys that's how you can change the payment date on a specific order inside a zip pay uh, I could tell you that uh, when I used it, they didn't even have it this way. You had to literally create a ticket and um, give them an order number. It was a process you had to go through in order for them to change the payment, um, to change the payment date for you. But now they've made it easier, easy as one, two, three. And then you couple that with the zip pay fiscal card that they 
put out, um, which I did a review video that you can check out um, by clicking the link in the description or at the end of this video, there'll be a thumbnail video to check it out. It's just so much great things that are happening with Zip, guys. But there you have it. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, guys, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button so that way you'll be notified every time I upload content as well as like the content lives, like the video, guys, if you see value in it. Helps with the helps with the algorithm, pushes it out to a broader audience to see it, guys. So with that being said, be awesome, live legendary, and as I always say, don't just hustle for the fame, guys. Hustle for your last name. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Take care.